Brendan, what are you doing? Oh, is uh, Clive coming? No, no. Okay, I was just playing some touch pits. Oh, good, because uh, Mr. Bobbles, he needs some friends. Oh, well, let's go on a little play date then. B Dog's always happy to meet me. Hey, what friends. are you guys doing? Oh, what's up, man? We're just playing some touch pits here. Oh, yeah, me too. Awesome. Awesome. Well, since we're, you know, all here socializing on this couch, uh, maybe it's time to talk about some of the social features that are in, you know, touch pets. Let's do it. So, Matt, I thought we'd start today by talking about some of the social features in the game. As you can see here, we're in the uh, dog feed. So, let's see, it says here at uh, Merwin's house... <laughs> uh, Mr. Bobbles is attracted to B-Dog and Mr. Bobbles like B-Dog's fashion sunglasses so we have a bunch of things here can you explain a little bit about this feed yeah the the dog feed is basically your a social feed that tells you what's happening on your network of friends among all their dogs just awesome. like Facebook or, or Friendster or a, uh, a Twitter feed so it's basically a summary of what's happening in in your social group. Okay, and then it looks like we also have the global feed here, which shows. Yeah, that's not what only that's what's you. going on on the whole server. Okay. So if you need to make friends, you can browse around on there and, and, and look for for people who have cool dogs and you can check out their dogs and see what they've done with with their right. with their virtual dogs. So if I move over to the friends tab here, it'll show. Looks like it'll show all my friends with touch pets. Exactly. This is your your plus friends list, and it lets you know who's playing touch pets and who who doesn't have the game yet. Okay. And you can see how they have progressed in the game. Everybody has a trainer, caretaker, and uh, social social level. So their dogs also, if you tap on any of those names, you can see the dogs that your it's friends own. MJ's profile here. Yeah, and you can see Mr. That, Bobbles. You can see that she has, has two dogs. And if you touch one of the dog's names, you can look at uh, information about the dog itself. So Very cool. You can see what's happened to the dog recently. And if you look in the upper right-hand corner, you can actually invite that dog over to your Here's device. A play date. Yeah, for um, a play date. I guess since MJ brought my dog over, I can bring hers over. Right, so what you what you uh, can do is you browse through the social network is find dogs that you think are interesting and invite them over and, and get to know them and then form relationships between your dog and those dogs. So you can see that uh, MJ's dog is, is dressed just the way that she left him the last time that she signed on so nice. you, you get to see what your friends are doing obviously my dog has much better fashion sense although no. <laughs> she's running around here well the, the first version of the game is going to have over 100 unique items so you'll be able to mix and match all sorts of That's uh, awesome. you know, come up with a really custom look for your dog and so, yeah i did buy some clothes earlier as well so i mean matt so like why why do i want to invite dogs over for play dates well, when you, when you take care of somebody else's dog, that's a change that that person will find out about the next time they sign on. So, for example, if you couldn't take care of your dog, you could ask Brandon to, to clean the dog for you or care for the dog for you, and, and that change you know, would, would go up to the server. And uh, you know, dogs have needs every day that they have to take care of. It's like the idea is it's a virtual pet that has regular needs, and Brandon can care for your dog or you can care for his if, if you can't make it online that day. So it's kind of like uh, pet sitting. Exactly, because it's like pet sitting for somebody else's dog. Very cool. Well, thanks for uh, showing us some of Touch Pets today. We look forward to the game coming out. Totally. Oh hey, I just got a I just got a notification that Mr. Bobble's status changed. Oh, well about that. That might be because uh, Mr. Bobble's needed a bath and B Dog was not digging that. Wait, at what, all. Are, what are you saying? Well, let's just say they're no longer seeing each other. Wait, wait. The global feed says that it's Mr. Bobbles who broke up with B Dog. Ooh. Well, I did see Boots looked a little bit lonely in the romance apartment, so uh, B Dog went on a play date with Boots. Your dog is such a tramp. She goes on play dates with everyone she encounters. Well, look how good she looks. <sighs> Anyways, guys, uh, thanks for tuning in this week and checking out some of Touch Pets. Yeah, we know you've been dying to see the game. And remember that you can hit us at podcast at mgmoco.com, and we'll do our best to make sure we're showing you, you know, what you want to see. We'll see you guys next time. Man, if B-Dog cheats on me one more time...